Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Students have the problem to write the sign of the inequality when they find the range. This is most important part in functions. Let's start. So I have divided this into two examples, example number one and example number two. In the first example, when you see the domain, the value of x is from minus two to two. And in quadratic equation, normally in quadratic functions, we have to use three coordinates. First with the minimum domain, which is here, maximum domain, which is here, and, and the turning point, most important part in quadratic function. So we have normally three coordinates to find the range. And same here, we have the domain minus three to zero, maximum and minimum domain, and the turning point. Okay, let's start. If you want to find the range, and there is a problem to write the sign of inequality, this sign here in the range. So we have a tip for you. When, uh, first of all, in these three coordinates, check it out. Check it out. What is the minimum value of y and the maximum value of y? Uh, minus 5, minus 1, and 0. Here y is minus 5, so, and 0. Minus one. So, which value is the minimum value? The minimum value of y is from minus five, and the maximum value of y is zero. Okay. So it means our range will be definitely between minus five. I have to write minus five here, and zero here. Even you can uh, like here understand by using this. Uh, if I just draw the little bit sketch here. Uh, and the turning point is 1, 0. So, minus and minus 2, minus 5 is coming. Suppose that this is minus 5. It's coming here. And minus 5 and the turning point is 1, 0 is coming here. I have to write here. 1, 0 is here. And on the turning point, normally we have the, the line of symmetry. And then we have 2 and minus 1 is suppose this is here. So this is the normal sketch like, like this. You can, this is like this actually, just roughly sketch I have drawn. So when we draw, when we find the range, we need the maximum value and the minimum value. So in between these, like this is called the range. And you can check the minimum value is minus 5 and the maximum value is 0. That's why we have minus 5 and 0. Okay, now problem with the sign. The sign means this minus 5, this minus 5 is here, this minus 5 is here, this minus 5 is with minus 2 and minus 2 is having only inequality greater than. So I will just write greater than not equal to, I will not write equal to only greater than. Like fx is greater than, but when I observe this part, which is coming 0, 0 is coming because of 1, not because of this 2, not because of this 2, this is coming because of 1. And this 1, when you observe in this ray, in this domain, minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, and 2, the 1 is coming here, and 1 is in between these domains. So I will write here equal to also because uh, if if we have two here, like if we have two here, then I have to write only less than not equal to. So this is the way we have, because the one is between the domain. So I have write equal to, okay. Now moving to example number two, the domain is minus three to zero. And one more thing here, we have three things. Most important part here, I want to say, when the turning point domain, then turning point domain, is, is in the given, like the like turning point domain is in the given domain, then we have to use turning point. So I have used, and I and I cut this part, like I did not use this one, because the turning point domain, the turning point X is in the given domain. So I have to use turning point here. When turning point X is one, and one is not in the given domain, so I will not use turning point. This is the first step. Turning point domain, like turning point x is in the given domain, I have to use turning point and any one coordinate, which is minimum value. Here, when turning point x is not in the given domain, I will not use turning point. Done. Now, we have to find the range from these two values. Minus 3 is coming minus 1. I will write minus 1 here and 3 here. So, this, like, if you want to know, like, how we can do with the sketch, like, just a little bit. 1, 
3 and this is minus 3. Minus 3 is giving us minus 1. So this is minus 3 and 1, this first coordinate. 0, 3 is, suppose it's coming here. And the turning point is coming, 1, 3 is about here. 1 and 5, sorry, 1 and 5 is coming, suppose here. So when I draw the sketch, I draw the sketch, I have to do like this. This is an actually exact sketch because the line of symmetry is always in the turning point. Okay. But if we observe our domain, the domain is from minus 3 to minus 3 to 0. So it means the sketch outside this domain, I will not use, I will not use this, I will not, I will use nothing now. This is your exact sketch for the given domain. So it means what is the minimum value? The minimum value is coming. Like this is the minimum value minus one and the maximum value of the curve is coming three. That's why we have minus one and three. Okay. I just explain. If you want to watch my video, this is how to find the range of the quality function. You should watch my video from the functions playlist. So now problem with this sign of inequality minus one is coming because of minus three and minus three is having this sign. So I will write this sign here. Very simple. This three is coming because of this zero and zero is having this sign so i will write this sign very simple the same sign i can write but here in the first example i have cleared that this one is between this domain so i have written i have written here like equal to also so by this way we have done this how we can put the sign of inequality in the range if you want to watch if you want to learn this how we can find the range please watch my playlist in the functions so Thank you so much and have a nice day.